The band that's been on the heart of indie rock fans for 20 years and is just out with its first new collection since 2001. Douglas Wolk of Pitchfork.com gives us a look at Super Chunk on ABC's New Music Monday. I think it's fair to call Super Chunk godfathers of indie music as we know it. They were not the first band to be playing, you know, loud, fast guitar stuff, but they kind of codified the style. They love big, big, big noise. They like things that make a gigantic racket. And there's a lot of bands that came after Superchunk that sound like them. This is actually their first recording of new studio music since 2001. For most of the last eight years, they play one or two live shows every year, and this record leaves in the gutter. They basically wrote because they wanted to have some new stuff when they played a few times a year. What's interesting about Leaves in the Gutter is that if this record had come out in 1994 instead of 2009, it would sound completely of the moment. It's good, sharp, clever, original, interesting songwriting, but it doesn't push beyond what they've done already. I can't hold my breath anymore. I stop swimming and love to serve. I think a lot of the songs on this record are about not caring about whether they're an important band anymore as long as they're having fun doing what they're doing. And I'm really happy to have a super chunk that is content to do what they do not worrying about where's the next breakthrough going to come from. And I'm really happy that they like doing that still. And if you want to check out an interview with Super Chunk's lead singer, you can go to abcnews.com slash amplified.